outside, these two in front of belts and braces, and then comes Forbear on the outside in search of a dream. Bilderberg now on the near side comes to join Monsieur Power. They're being followed towards the outside by in search of a dream. Inside the last 200 now, and Bilderberg is the leader. Going on from Monsieur Power on the outside of in search of a dream with belts and braces, but Bilderberg racing up to the finish, strides on four length winner for Colin Keane. Second home is Monsieur Power. Belts and braces in search of a dream, followed in by Forbear and next Ben. They're being followed towards the outside by In Search of a Dream. Inside the last 200 now, and Bilderberg is the leader. Going on from Monsieur Power on the outside of In Search of a Dream with belts and braces, but Bilderberg racing up to the finish, strides on four length winner for Colin Keane. Second home is Monsieur Power. Belts and braces in search of a dream. Result of the first race, the Eskies Live After Racing Maiden. 6-3-5, number seven was fourth, and number one was fifth. And FOMO, just the back marker. Off the bend now to straighten up for home, and it is Cape Wolf on the rail from Cregeen on the outside of Sir Roston. They're being followed by Jeremy's Joy. Beginning the run now to the final furlong and a half. Cape Wolf pressed now by Crujean on the near side. Sir Roston in between horses and down the outside. Agnes Stewart trying to pick up Jeremy's Joy on the inside. Crujean now with Agnes Stewart coming right up on the near side as they race inside the last 150 yards now. And Agnes Stewart has quickened past Crujean as they run up towards the finish. And Agnes Stewart stretches on to win by a good four lengths for Billy Lee in second place. Is Crujean with Agnes Stewart coming right up on the near side as they race inside the last 150 yards now and Agnes Stewart has quickened past Crujean as they run up towards the finish and Agnes Stewart stretches on to win by a good four lengths for Billy Lee in second place is Crujean Jeremy's joy on result of the second race six seven eight and a photo for fourth place six seven eight and a photo Sparrow is just in behind with Tubbin. Want to be better towards the inside. Sea of Wells. Calafante picks up on the outside. Racing on now towards the final furlong. Majestic Queen challenged by Tubbin in the centre. Down the outside. Calafante. Want to be better trying to improve. And then Sparrow as they race now to the final 100 yards. And it's Tubbin now on the near side from on the far side. Majestic Queen as they race up towards the finish now. It's Tubbin and Kevin Manning is going to score from Majestic Queen. Close for the third between Calafante down the outside Calafante want to be better trying to improve and then Sparrow as they race now to the final hundred yards and it's Tubbin now on the near side from on the far side Majestic Queen as they race up towards the finish now it's Tubbin and Kevin Manning is going to score from Majestic Queen close for the third between Calafante want to be better Sparrow whimsical sea of wells result of the third race 5-1 and a photo 5-1 and a photo as they approach the turn in, the Kale on the inside of That's a Fret, Al Jowser towards the near side, that three are being followed by Hallerath. And after these comes Hatton Cross, beginning now to race to the final furling and a half. La Kayla pressed in the centre by Al Jowser. That's a fret comes next. Sweet Anathea trying to join in. Hallerat and Hatton Cross and then Shabra Emperor racing now towards the final 200 yards. And La Kayla pressed now in the centre by Al Jowser. Shabra Emperor coming home in third, racing up towards the finish now. Al Jowser from La Kayla and Shabra Emperor. And as they hit the line, Al Jowser and Lee Roach will beat La Kayla. Shabra Emperor's third. 200 yards and La Kayla pressed now in the centre by Al Jowza. Shabra Emperor coming home in third, racing up towards the finish now. Al Jowza from La Kayla and Shabra Emperor and as they hit the line. Al Jowza and Lee Roach will beat La Kayla. Shabra Emperor's third and close for fourth. Sweet Anatea in company. Result of the fourth race, the Labuka Restaurants Handicap. 8 6 5. Number seven was fourth and number two was fifth. Then to Blackstone and Ayontas, who's being followed by Pretty Angel Sandy Smile. Local Flyer now pressed by Royal Memory in the centre. A couple of lengths to Bint Dandy and Focus, and then Muscle Beach. Racing on now past the two mark. Local Flyer against the rail, pressed on the near side by Royal Memory. A couple of lengths to Muscle Beach in third, and they're being followed in fourth by Bint Dandy and Focus. Local Flyer being pressed by Royal Memory, and on the outside, Muscle Beach coming home well, and Muscle Beach now goes to the front. 
one from local flyer and royal memory as they run up towards the finish. Muscle Beach goes on to score for Franberry. Royal memory is second. And on the outside, pretty outside, Muscle Beach coming home well. And Muscle Beach now goes to the front from local flyer and royal memory as they run up towards the finish. Muscle Beach goes on to score for Franberry. Royal memory is second. And on the outside, pretty angel might just grab the third ahead of focused Sandy Smile and local flyer. Result of the fifth race, the Lyraith Estate and Spa Summer Ladies' Day, 13th of July at Fairy House Handicap. 3-1-5. Number eight was fourth and number two was fifth. Goes for home, use at six, goes after the leader, followed then by Smoker on the inside with Snow Scene and Grecian Tiger trying to pick up on the outside of Melanippi. Queen of Alba now pressed by News at six, a couple of lengths to Snow Scene and Grecian Tiger. News at six goes to the front from Queen of Alba. Snow Scene and Grecian Tiger next. They're racing now to the final furlong and News at six is out in front. Snow Scene, Queen of Alba and Grecian Tiger, but it's News at six who's way out in front following up his victory at the current recently and will complete a double for Kevin Manning and Jim Bulger as News at six is going to win by over six as they go to the line. News at six clear, judge for second, Grecian Tiger, Queen of Alba, six who's way out in front following up his victory at the current recently and will complete a double for Kevin Manning and Jim Bulger as News at six is going to win by over six as they go to the line. News at six clear, judge for second, Grecian Tiger, Queen of Alba, Snow scene clear of Smoker and Melanippi. Full result of the sixth race, the Ratoth Garden Centre rated race. One, two, four. Number three was fourth and number five was fifth. So they're coming off the turn now with two and a half to go and straightening up for home. Panama Hat in the lead from Wildcat Kitten on the outside. Sariha on the inside of Port Marion. They're followed by Mystic Princess. Panama Hat from Wildcat Kitten. They're being followed by Sariha and Port Marion on the outside. Panama Hat continuing in front now to the final furlong from Wildcat Kitten in second and in third place is Sariha. Panama Hat continuing in front now as they race inside the last 200 and it is Panama Hat out in front, Sariha on the inside of Wildcat Kitten and running up towards the finish. Panama Hat's going to make all the win by four to five lengths. Sariha second, Wildcat Kitten is third and they're followed in by Port Mary in front now as they race inside the last 200 and it is Panama Hat out in front, Sariha on the inside of Wildcat Kitten and running up towards the finish. Panama Hat's going to make all the win by four to five lengths. Sariha second, Wildcat Kitten is third and they're followed in by Port Mary in clear of Mystic Prince. Princess. Result of the seventh race, the Bobby Joe Bistro Great Value Packages Handicap. Two, one, five. Number three was fourth, number four was fifth.